Welcome to the found footage show. If you like haunted stuff and you like discoveries, you've came to the right place. Welcome to the very first episode of the found footage. I've been waiting to do this series for a long freaking time. As you all know that the first season we're starting is The Rake. Now all of you might be wondering, oh, The Rake is fake. You're probably not going to find them. Well, the thing is, the whole point of the series is to prove if it, is, if it is real or not. Just to explain to you guys what the series is going to be all about, that basically each season in the series is going to have three episodes. Tres, amigo! All three episodes are going to be like each step of what we're going to be doing here. First step is going to be explanation and history of the person, place, or thing and evidence that this person, place, or thing exists. And the third step is capturing the place or person or thing on camera. Now on to the story. A family was on their way back home from Niagara Falls waiting to go to back to sleep. And then all of a sudden, the, the wife wakes up at 4 a.m. And she wakes up to her husband freaking out like, <gasps> and then, uh... And what they saw uh, sitting on the edge of their bed was the rake. And then the rake quickly turned around, looked at him very funny looking. And then he, he just like he ran out of their bedroom, uh, down the end of their hallway into their kid's room. Before they got to their kid's room, they saw that the rake was just sitting in their, their, their daughter's bedroom, covered in blood. And then the creature quickly just ran out of the house and broke through. When they got into their daughter's bedroom, they saw that her, their daughter had scratches all over her body. And her last words were, it's the rake. Her husband was driving her daughter to the hospital and then he lost control while driving the car. There was something wrong with it. And they accidentally drove into a, into the water and killed them both. A while during the incident, uh, the police were involved into the incident, and um, the the mom and their other kid, I think it was her son, I think, they were staying at a hotel near their mom's house, and then they saw. Like a few, she saw like a few other people that had the same exact situation dealing with the rake. And then all four of them, there wasn't just a few, there, there was there was four of them. They were trying to prove to a lot of people that the rake exists. And no one didn't really believe them. And then there's, there is videos on the internet. There actually is videos on the internet of the rake being spotted. There's the first one, I'm not sure what his, his name was, but it was on YouTube. This guy has been hearing noises outside of his house. And he went to see what it was. And he was like, hello, who's there? And... And he saw that the rake was charging at him and he sprint and he quickly sprinted back to his house. And there was one in Mexico also where um where a group of Mexican people were out in the woods uh, doing the he was hearing the same type of noise and they could quote they saw the rake on video also. And then when the sightings like continued on they haven't been spotted all around the world. They've only been spotted in the northeastern side of the United States. And, um, so in episode three, I'm going to try to go somewhere near the northeastern side of the United States to see if it exists or not. Well, that's going to be it for episode one. In episode two, I'm going to try to like go to different states in the northeastern side and like try to get some evidence of this creature in episode three i'm gonna go to the the exact location where it probably could be now and try to capture it on camera so be ready for episode two